Daddy, you go crazy. DJ UTV, let them know who we got in the building. Real Montana. Real Montana, what you on, gang? I'm chilling. Welcome I'm to DJ chilling. UTV. It's definitely a blessing to have you. Nice to be here. For sure. Uh, you know, there's been a lot going on in the, in the, in the, in the media lately, you know? Mm -hmm. um, well, you and I, we, we spoke, you know, previously about, about a year ago, you know? Mm -hmm. So, uh, I think, I think, I think, I think we, we, we in for a good one, you know? <laughs> uh, uh, Montana, you start by telling us uh, where you're from. Chicago, Ovis, like around 73rd and Jeff. Okay. And I'm from um, Boucher and South Shore, shit like that. Word. So you east side crazy. So you can tell us what it was like for you growing up over east? Um, shit was regular. Like, I had like a regular life, to be honest. Like, the regular kid life. I mean, I was fighting shit, like doing bad shit. That's got, like, I wanted to. But other than that, I had a regular life. Okay. What was your family, family uh, household like? Siblings? Both parents? I got 13 brothers and sisters. Wow. I had both parents in my household, but they, one wound up leaving. Then my daddy wound up here somewhere and shit, so. I had two parent households until the end. So it was all 13 brothers and sisters under one roof? Mm-hmm, at first. Okay. But then like, as like 10 got older, everybody went to say like, with this family member or, you know, wherever they want to go. Okay. And at birth, you were born a, bo a boy, correct? Now see, we're not doing that. <laughs> <laughs> we're not doing that one. I was born trans. That's what I am. Trans. You born trans. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. So, trans is a jer uh, a third gender. Is what you're saying? Um, <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm like, if you want to call it a gender, yeah. I mean, I'm just saying, like, you know. At birth is what I'm asking, mm -hmm. you know, when you can't. No, it's, it's different. Like, you get, okay, you get, like, drag queens and shit, then you get, like, trans, you just got, like, crazy people. It's different. Like, you got to actually be, like, medically diagnosed and shit like that, too. Okay. So, most people y'all be talking to be, like, drag queens. Like that. You said we were <laughs> talking about drag queens? <laughs> yeah. 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 For real. Okay, I'm confused. So what's the difference in like a drag queen versus what, a regular trans woman? Like, boom, okay. Drag queen, you got like a drag queen, they like, she like dress up and shit when they want to. Like RuPaul? Yeah. <laughs> That's a drag queen? Yeah. Okay. Like RuPaul. Then you got in between, which is like, they're a boy at night, then they get in drag. I mean, then they're a boy in the morning, then get in drag at night. Okay. Then you got real trans people where they was medically diagnosed, hormones, all this other stuff. It's just, it's a lot that come with it. Right. It's not that you can't just wake up and be like, oh, da da da. But that's what a lot of people do. But it's not like that. Okay. And especially for me, it wasn't like that. So you identify yourself as like 100% trans? <laughs> I identify as a woman before anything. Okay. okay. So, but trans come later. But I'm still a human being, so at the end of the day, I'm a woman. So as far as pronouns go, I am to refer to you, she, her, correct? Okay. Uh, so tell us though the challenges of um, a trans. I feel like, I mean, this Chicago, everybody got their own little life that they gonna live or go, you know what I mean? It's either like, I feel like it's how you grow up and I feel like it's who you got around you, you know, who you know or like, you know, if you got like siblings, it's just like a lot to play in the world. If you just a goofy, like, you know what I mean? I feel like it's just a lot that play in. Some people go through a lot, some people don't. Like me personally, I went through shit cause, like on my own time. Not because like somebody bashing me or trying to fight me on that type of shit or something like that. I just did shit on my own. Just being a child. Versus I seen a lot of other people like, you know, get like picked on and shit like that. But that wasn't the case for me. Right. Which I'm blessed, so. So you never like had any situation where you were like, discriminated against for being? Mm -hmm. I had, yeah, I've been discriminated against, okay. but not like as far as in maliciously. Like I've been discriminated against like trying to get a little job or like, you know, little shit like that or like just judge off my appearance, shit like that. Other than that. Right. DJ 
DJ, you go crazy!